Hi there, this is Bill, and this is a program that draws windows in plan view and in elevation. That is just a rough idea of a house. This rectangle, I've just offset that one and made it to be, can be anywhere, a um, floor level of, of for the elevations. The elevation can go here, 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 and here. In other words, looking onto the house. Okay, so the program that I've written is in Lisp and called WinH. So you choose a letter, a, a window from a listing. So for instance, I might choose uh, W3, which is a little awning window with a fixed pane under it. So I just hit enter on that. And then I tell it what height do I want that to be. Say I want it to be 1.2 high. And then I tell it that I maybe want it to be 0.8 of a meter wide. And I pick the left hand corner of the room and the right hand corner. Don't mind all those other things that are in the drawing. Um, they're just there. I'm too lazy. And job done comes back again and you can see that it puts not only the width the height and the width in but it draws a little window right where you want it to be in other words joining that up with that have got other 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 ones here's one most windows most ordinary windows that use used in New Zealand are in there for instance, this one here is WinH, just um, maybe the window type is W11, and the height I might make that 1.2, and the width I might make that 3 metres. Left hand corner, it always puts it central in the room, which is quite normal for these sort of things. I mean, if you wanted it in a different place can do so. So it's asking me for a desired sash width here. So I'd say, well, that's uh, 700 mil would be uh, a good width. And there it is. It's drawn the sashes, and that's the width. Everything's on there. Okay, so here's another little uh, wrinkle here. Um, drawing doors is always a pain. So I've got one here called Door V. So defaults to 760 which is a common door size and you just pick the intersection and bing you've got your your door hit enter enter again and so if you wanted to choose a different size maybe you wanted a 710 door 710 and pick there and pick there so that's now 710 door these are very simple straightforward doors Thanks for watching, these take ages to do.